A recent proposition from a group of American geologists and anthropologists from the University of Kansas has sparked a new conversation in the realm of space exploration. They've put forth the idea of the lunar Anthropocene, a term to recognize humanity's growing impact on the moon. As we look up at the night sky, it's important to remember that our reach extends even there, with multiple national space agencies from India to the US, the Soviet Union to China and Japan, all increasing their lunar activities. These activities are not without consequence, as they're leaving indelible marks on our closest celestial neighbor. We're not just talking about footprints and flags here. The machinery we use, the artifacts we leave behind, they all contribute to this lunar Anthropocene. Just like on Earth, our actions have impacts that extend far beyond our immediate vicinity. The proposition of the lunar Anthropocene is not just about labeling, but about awareness and management. It's about acknowledging that our actions on the moon have effects that need to be considered and managed. The authors believe that by labeling this impact as the lunar Anthropocene, agencies and governments will better appreciate the importance of managing our mark on the moon. But it's not just about managing our impact, it's also about preserving our history. As we push the boundaries of human exploration, we leave behind artifacts that tell the story of our journey. These remnants scattered on the lunar surface are markers of our activity, much like the archaeological wonders we find here on Earth. Just as archaeologists sift through the sands of time to uncover our past, the moon could become a site for future studies. Each mission, each footprint, each piece of machinery left behind becomes a part of our enduring legacy in the cosmos. These artifacts are not just space debris, but chapters in our unfolding saga of exploration and discovery. The lunar Anthropocene, then, is not merely a term. It's a call to recognize our impact and our responsibility. It's a call to preserve our cosmic footprints, not just for us, but for future generations who will look back at our time as pioneers of the final frontier. Our history on the moon is more than a record of human activity. It's a testament to our curiosity, our courage, and our collective aspiration. As we continue to reach for the stars, we must also remember to respect and preserve our cosmic heritage. In conclusion, the Lunar Anthropocene is not just a label, but a call to action. It emphasizes our role in shaping the Moon's future, urging us to tread lightly, responsibly, to continuously be enlightened, like and subscribe.